question 36 evaluate the wrong skin of the function y1 x is equal to sin x and y2 x is equal to sin x minus cos x and hence conclude whether or not they are uh, linearly independent also form the differential equation uh, the question 35 has same uh, y, uh, uh, y1 x and y2 x and the solution uh, uh, is same the part a solution of question 36 is same uh, for question 35 and 36 so I, anyway I will just since it is a simple solution I will just write down the Ronsky and prove w of x is equal to y1 x y2 x y1 dash x y2 dash x so which becomes here sin x sin x minus cos x cos x cos x plus sin x so when we evaluate this we get Ronskin as 1 so uh, uh, the steps were given in uh, given uh, in the previous question you can refer that if needed so we got Ronskin as 1 uh, so it is not equal to 0 uh, so they are uh, these solutions uh, y1 x and y2 x are linearly independent uh, we got that part now we have to form the differential equation uh, so that was not discussed in the previous question uh, and since uh, since uh, the solutions are li linearly independent we can write y equal to a into a constant a into sin uh, a need not be a constant a and b are parameters a, a, a sin x plus b sin x minus cos x so this be our equation 1 now we can write uh, y dash as a into um, cos x plus b into cos x plus sin x so this is our equation 2 now y double dash is equal to so differentiating uh, I'm just differentiating uh, with respect to x a into minus a sin x plus b into minus sin x plus cos x so this is 3 if you see uh, 3 and 1 when added together results in 0 so using 1 and 3 we can write y double dash plus y equal to 0 so this is the required differential equation so uh, so that is the solution so I am just uh, this part was there in the previous question and just for such a question this is how we form the differential equation so this is the question 36 so I will discuss one more question since this was a small question so uh, so next question is show that question 37 show that x and x e raised to x are linearly independent on x axis so we have our y1 x as x and y2 x as x e raised to x so we can write down the wrong wrong skin to see y1 x y2 x y1 dash x y2 dash x so wrong skin is so this becomes uh, x x e raised to x minus 1 and x into e raised to x plus e raised to x so this when opening therefore w x is equal to if you open x square e raised to x plus x e raised to x 
minus x e raised to x. Therefore, we get Ronskian as x square e raised to x. Now, we know that uh, w x is not equal to 0 uh, for, uh, for, for all x uh, in the interval 0 to infinity. So, for for x not equal to 0 we can just try x not equal to 0 and uh, since we have uh, w x not equal to 0 for x not equal to 0 in x axis so we can say therefore y1 of x and y2 of x are linearly independent That is the solution to the question 37.